Uh, the purpose of the lodge is it's a retreat building and it's also a place where our male summer staff live. We think it's probably part of the original camp along with the social hall, so late 1800s. There's rectangular nails in there, you know, so very old school. Passive House is a building standard. It's to make a building robust and highly energy efficient to use um, up to 70% less energy um, overall and 90% less energy to heat and cool. So basically you're, you don't want any air moving in and out of the house that you're not controlling. We passed out, there's, a, there's an air barrier, so we're trying to create a completely sealed box. Think of it like a cooler. So we want a completely sealed box with a bunch of insul uninterrupted insulation on the outside. So our air barrier, for example, here is the sheathing. It's all taped so no air can leak through the sheathing. Um, our roof is taped as well. And then a whole bunch of insulation gets bolted onto the outside. Think of it like a blanket that goes over the whole building. In a typical residential construction, just, you would have an equivalent opening of maybe about this big um, of all your holes in your buildings with nail holes, everything. With Passive House, it's down to like this big. So it's like a third. Net, yeah. Is right. there a savings in cost to building the project? We've taken on the builder role to try to get our costs down to cost parity. Uh, with conventional construction. There's a lot of interest in this type of construction um, and people want to be in these buildings. Also it's a chance to live out our values, you know, we're creating a structure that has very low environmental impact, very low um, uh, abetted carbon um, footprint to it. Okay, ready? Okay.